One, two, three, fuck it. I'm not sure how I feel about this one. These are so expensive. A box. I put it in this like weird box. This is too much. Blue and purple kind of ombre. Hey guys, welcome to the video. Today I'm going to be showing you my phone case collection. I keep it in this like weird box. We've got a lot here. I mean, compared to like some people, this is not a lot, but to me, this is too much. I just have so many and I thought I might as well just show you. All right, gentlemen, I want you to repeat after me just how I do it. Ready? Your turn. Okay, so first we're going to get started with the one that is currently on my phone. I have this elephant's one on my phone currently. It just has blue and purple kind of ombre elephants all across it and it has a clear side to it. I really love this one because it's pretty unique. It has the white background and the ombre elephants and it's actually one of my favorites because it's so pretty and cute. This came in a set. I'll show you the rest of them later. Bye-bye. I actually really like that one. It's kind of cute. And I said it was in a set. So I've got one, two, three, four, five more that came in the set. I believe it was about $7. And there were like six cases off of Amazon. So they do chip sometimes. But I think one of my favorites is definitely the one that I just showed you. Next on the elephant's theme in the set. I have this elephant one. It is basically just a huge black elephant. I'm actually not obsessed with elephants. They just came in the set and I thought it was pretty cute. So this black one has a lot of pretty details on it and it has the same white background and is also one of my favorites. I really like that one and next up we have this skull. It hasn't chipped yet and I really do like the colors. It's pretty cool but I'd say I like the elephant ones more than this one. I still think this one is very pretty and I like it because it's unique. I don't really see a lot of people who have a similar design on their case. Ooh, next is one of my favorites in this set. I've got this Dreamcatcher one. I just love the colors. I think it's so pretty. It has such a beautiful color scheme that's like galaxy, but still pretty bright and light. And I just think it's really pretty. I don't really do dream catchers or anything. I just thought the design was gorgeous. Ooh, fancy word there. This one has chipped a little bit, but it's not very noticeable. And I just think the color scheme is so pretty. This is definitely one of my favorites for the set. Next is kind of a cute one. This is the one that chipped mainly. And it's like this cat kissing a fish. I don't know. It's kind of weird, but kind of cute at the same time. Yeah, so the concept is a little weird, but it's just cute little cartoon animals. And I really do like it. It is a bit chipped though, which is kind of annoying. But I mean, what can you expect for like a dollar or two? I'm not sure how I feel about this one. Next is one that it just kind of like came in the set and I didn't really want it. It's this one that says Crazy Unicorn Lady. I actually like the purple background color, but I don't really like this case overall just because the design is weird and it doesn't really apply. It's not shipped because I don't like it and I don't put it on my phone, so <laughs> bye. Next, I want to move on to a couple phone cases that I got from Claire's. They do have really expensive ones, but when I first started out, I just got a couple from there. I got all these phone cases and it's like I was gonna change them and stuff, but you know, you just like leave it on for a year. So I should definitely change them more often. First off from Claire's, we've got the one that I had on my phone originally. It's this tie-dye case and it says smile on it. I love the tie-dye. I believe I got this like on vacation last summer when we went to Rehoboth with my whole family. I do really like it. I just think it's kind of cute and fun. This one's just a bright tie-dye one. It's fun and kind of summery. I really do like tie-dye, so I think the colors are just bright enough and perfect. I believe this was around $10. Next, we've got this clear metallic one. It has like this ring for your finger in the middle of it. I haven't put this one on in such a long time. I think it's really cool, but my phone color, I don't like too much. It's just kind of dirty. I need to 
clean it and then maybe the silver will be a little prettier with this case. I've been really liking pastel colors lately, but I still do think this is kind of cool with the metallic and I feel like it's kind of unique too. But again, I just don't think the silver really matches well, but I still think it's pretty and it's cool that it has the little ring thing. And that one, I believe, was also $10. I've got this marble one. It is pink, and it's just got, like, blue and gold marble on it. And then I've got this pop socket, which is white and has, like, the marbling on it. I actually bought this when I first got my phone a while ago from Claire's, and I got a matching pop socket. I think it's a really cool combination, and it's just kind of fun. These are so expensive, but the case is so pretty. I actually really love this combination and I definitely should put it on more often. Who knows what case I'm gonna put on after this. I do actually have one last Claire's one and it is this one. It's a really pretty pattern and it's got like pink, purple, and blue on it. And then in the middle, it's got another like finger ring thingy. When I first got it, I was obsessing over how it was a big pattern in the case. It got smaller on the ring thing and then it was tiny on the keychain. I think it's pretty and ombre and kind of pastel. Also, it has this matching keychain thingy on it, so I can just like wear it like this. I haven't changed my cases in so long, I really should. I love all these cases. On a different note, let's move on to one that I hate. Here it is. This is a sequiny one. I think we were at Stables one time and it was like a dollar. It's really stiff and kind of uncomfortable. So here's the Staples one and I was actually kind of like tilting it in the sunlight, especially with the purple. It looked super cool and like kind of changed colors. So at least that's one thing that's super cool about it. I don't really like it. Yeah. Nope. <laughs> Next, I have these two that I got from like a phone case store in Rehoboth when we went there. All these cases I haven't put on my phone in such a long time. This one is a pineapple. It's half pink and half kind of gold marble. And then it's got this pop socket which matches and I just think it's super cute. It's also got a really pretty like finish on it and it's kind of shiny. You like me always trying the transitions throughout the video. Anyways, this one is pretty cool and if you line up the pop socket right, it looks really cool. And Oh, there's Kitty. Seriously, you always gotta be right where the action is. These were pretty expensive. They were like $17, which I know is a lot. And the last case is also from the store in Rehoboth. It is this marble case that is pink and blue and has a matching pop socket. It also has a pretty similar finish on it that I just think is really pretty. I have so many cases that have like marbling on them. But it's just got clear sides and I definitely should clean a couple of my cases and my phone. So I'm probably gonna do that after this. Okay, you guys, so that is all my phone cases, but I want to rank them for you. And I also wanna pick one, a new one, to put in my phone. So let's do that. Here I've got them all laid out and how this is gonna work is I'm going to go from least favorite to favorite. And then I'll pick one of them to put in my phone. In last place, I think I'm gonna have to go with the unicorn one. It's just kind of ugly and it's very weird. And then the sequin one was actually kind of cool and light, but it's still gonna get second to last because it's really not good and I don't really like it. I think next it's either between the skull or the chipped one. I'm gonna go with the chipped one because I like I mean, it's sometimes cute, but again, it's kind of a weird design, and it is chipped, so that's a no-no. And then next is the skull one. Fifth to last might have to be this one, just because the silver, I don't think it looks that great with this one, but I still like it, and it's kind of cool. Next, I think I'm going to go with this big elephant one. I still like it. There's just a bunch of others that have more color that I like more. And then I think I'd say the watercolor one. That might surprise you. I don't know why. 
I just kind of like the other ones better for some reason. But I still really love this one. Also, if you made it this far in the video, comment down below which one of all of them is your favorite. Hmm. Maybe the elephants is gonna go. I think it's like a five-way tie. And I think the pineapple, um, I don't know, it's just a lot of white and I'm feeling color today, I guess. Okay, now let me show you the progress so far. Here it is going from last place. Creeping up to the ones I really like. And we have four left, so yeah, let's decide. Okay, next, I think I'm gonna eliminate this one because it is a bit chipped and it's not the best quality, but I still really like it. I really like this one, but I don't know how it made it this far. I, I don't know. The final round between the marble one with the pop socket and the tie-dye one with the smile. And the winner is the tie-dye one. Overall, that might be my favorite right now, but I still really love them. And now I have to pick one that I wanna put on my phone right now. In the end, I just decided on this one because it was fun and pretty. All right, you guys, that is it for today's video. Thank you all so, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. And as always, I will see you in the next one. Bye. All right, gentlemen. I want you to repeat after me just how I do it. Ready? Your turn.